Welcome back astronomy lovers. Today we'll be talking about another interesting planet in our solar system, Uranus. Rather than giving a brief overview of the planet, we are going to dive a bit deeper into one aspect of Uranus that sets it apart from every other planet that we have ever observed, its tilt. As you may recall from one of our prior videos, Venus, for example, spins in the opposite direction, therefore the sun rises in the west and sets in the east. Uranus, for an unknown but deeply hypothesized reason, is completely tilted to its side, so it is virtually spinning sideways. In this video, we will discuss some of the theories that attempt to solve this mystery while going over the differences in Uranus due to its sideways spin. For a long time, scientists thought that Uranus was tilted due to a single impact from a celestial object billions of years ago. Scientists often look at the moons of Uranus to try and determine if any remnant from said object still remains. The idea that Uranus was hit by an object actually contradicts the existing standard planet formation theory. Alessandro Morbidelli, study leader of this crazy mystery, stated, The standard planetary formation theory assumes that Uranus, Neptune, and the cores of Jupiter and Saturn form by accreting only small objects in the protoplanetary disk. They should have suffered no giant collisions. The fact that Uranus was hit at least twice suggests that significant impacts were typical in the formation of giant planets. So the standard theory has to be revised. The idea that a single powerful object caused Uranus's tilt was later disproved after running rigorous computer simulations. After they ran the computer simulation with a single collision, they found that the collision likely occurred in the solar system's very early days when Uranus was still surrounded by the disk of dust and gas that would eventually form its moons. The moons would share Uranus's tilt, which they indeed do. So far, so good. But then the simulations offered up a surprise. If there was just one collision, Uranus's moons would display retrograde motion, orbiting in the opposite direction than that which astronomers observe today. To account for the discrepancy, they found that a series of at least two smaller collisions can explain the moon's motions much better than a single giant impact. The early solar system thus may have been a more volatile and more violent place than previously thought. Morbidelli and his team not only created the best hypothesis for this theory, but they also shed light onto the early solar system, describing for the first time how truly violent it probably was back then. Well, that's a brief introduction to the mystery behind Uranus's sideways spin. We really hope you enjoyed this video, and please take time to check out some more of the other astronomy videos in our library at LDC Media. We'd be grateful if you would subscribe to our YouTube channel. We continue to add new videos regularly. Thanks for watching.